Scotland ceased to be an independent country over three centuries ago, and we now tend to view the nation's linguistic heritage through the prism of English. When we focus upon the influence English has exerted over Scots and Gaelic over the ages, we neglect a much richer story. Ignoring previous relationships between the various Scottish languages can make us see them as a source of division and weakness. Lowlander against Norseman against Gael. But, in fact, these voices have combined to sing a distinctly Scottish song. It's this diversity which is the source of our cultural richness and goes to the very heart of what it means to be Scottish. Until now, it has been impossible to fully comprehend how this narrative forms a single coherent Scottish story. But in a series of articles about the languages of Scotland, Paul Kavanagh brings clarity to this relationship. To read Paul Kavanagh's series on the history of Scottish languages, visit newsnetscotland.com.